political cowboy bucked. He came into this thing third, ranked third in the world. When you consider, I have no clout in that in the bucking bull world. Right. I have no clout <laughs> there. Um, but we got fortunate with this particular bull, who's very good. And a shout good out to bull. my buddy, my uh, stock contractor Clint Gant over in Louisiana, who. He ran, he ran those bulls up and down the road all season long and mm-hmm. put in the miles, and wow. uh, God bless him for doing it. But uh, he's a business partner of mine, and, and uh, Jimmy Rogers with Boots for Troops, he owns a little piece of that bull too. and um, He was just something special, right? So he comes into this thing Friday night, into the World Finals, ranked third. Um, had, a pretty good, had a pretty good run Friday night, and then – uh, he wound up in fifth place for that event and then wound up, they bucked more the next night. There's a lot of bulls in this. He wound up overall for that particular, for the weekend in 10th place for that event, but fourth in the world. So he got okay. edged out. We thought we had third, but we found out late Saturday uh, night that by a fraction of a decimal point, he geez. got, he was fourth. Still good. Yeah. Still good. Next year when he's a four year old, going to be a huge year for him going to be a huge year for all of us because now we're getting into the real deal so you know i talk about i put it on twitter and all Mm -hmm. this because i'm all hat no cattle right oh of course yeah Yeah. i I don't have anything to do with any anything livestock right i just wear this hat (laughs) but uh you know some of the trolls came out yesterday morning saying oh he his bull is is not even his it's in louisiana it's well that's where we keep the bulls right on Clint's ranch. That's what we do. Uh, did, they, did they not realize, and, like, when you own livestock, you don't always just keep them on your property? Yeah, I don't keep them in the backyard. The Homeowners <laughs> Association has a thing yeah. about that, right? A weird thing, yeah. So, you know, it, believe it or not, most most people in the world, you know, if you don't live on a ranch, yeah. you have a place you where you pay. keep your yes. animals. Yeah. Yes. So, um, and I don't live on a ranch, believe it or not. I don't. I am the richest cowboy in Texas. Because but I don't live on a ranch. Because you don't live on a ranch. I have, <laughs> I have, but I don't anymore. And you're right because I've always said never have a hobby that eats. Now I've always had hobbies that eat, <laughs> but I don't have any horses right now. Yeah. But I do have the bulls, and so and I trust me, I feed them. It's so <laughs> I can't uh, even imagine. I, yeah, it, we help feed them. But uh, I always say I come from a family with cowboys in it. I'm the least cowboy of all of them, but I am a damn good business guy. <laughs> and somebody said to me, uh, in fact, a good friend of mine who's, I won't say his name, he's very well known in the world of bucking bulls. He said to me the other night, he said, he said, if you got money, son, you ain't no real cowboy. <laughs> That's funny. That's really funny. So uh, he's right about that in that regard. I'm, a bit, I'm not a cowboy. I'm a cattleman. A big difference. Well, I don't know because in the documentary that I watched called Yellowstone, yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah, Dutton, John Dutton, yeah. is very. He seems very rich, very rich, he but he's cowboy. always fighting to keep it. He doesn't want to go broke. Well, that's right? fair. Okay, he's, that's he's fighting fair. because they're trying to take his ranch. Yeah. So anyway, but anyway, they came at me and they were like, "Somebody posted a thing and said Prather, he's a rhinestone cowboy. He's easy to catch in a lie. His bull's not even ranked." And they showed the premiere. Bulls oh. of the PBR, the top mm-hmm. five, mm-hmm. you know, like Bushwhacker and all this. Yeah. It's like, yeah, we're a three year old Derby Bull. We're not, we're not at the, that's like saying, that's like looking at the major league roster right. and not paying attention to the guy that's playing double A AA or triple A. Right. 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 So I love these trolls. They try so hard to research. They really think they've got it. And it's like, dude, you worked so hard to take that L. Yeah. Like, just they own really it. They really think they've own got it. it. 